I heard you say Space Kings. That's enough. I'm sure I've said something. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, we have Space Kings. And yeah. we have those episodes that I haven't got to upload yet. Yeah, there's lots of Where you two get trapped in a bar stupid. for an hour. Space Kings. <laughs> <laughs> hey everybody, I'm Jason. And I'm Paul. And welcome to Geek Culture Live. This is our weekly in this is our weekly live interactive podcast. So live that I can't redo that. Oh, uh, thank God, because you should have <laughs> heard me record commercials before. I sat in my closet for like an hour just saying the same thing over and over and kept messing up when I did the Lazunica commercial. <laughs> I, I messed it up How so How long many, was that commercial? Like 30 seconds. <laughs> 30 seconds long, and I messed it up every single time. Uh, thanks for joining the show. We uh, do, like I said, a weekly live interactive broadcast. Uh, podcast. 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 I'm done talking. Paul? <laughs> it's a broadcast. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Aunt Pat. Hi, Courtney. Hi, Jason. Hi, Ace. You, you said hi to me. I did. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Hi, Ace. Hi, Courtney. Hi. Okay, so um, really quick, one of the first things we always like to do is give a shout out to our patrons. So, Paul, do you know who our patrons are? Uh, some of them. Some of them. <laughs> <laughs> we got to get like a list coming up. So we have we have Jennifer, we have Pablo, we have Catherine, we have... Um, Jake. Jake. We have Eric, or do we call him Kevin now? The thing's running on so long, I don't remember. We're gonna keep calling him Kevin. Kevin. Uh, we have. We also have Vivian. Vivian is responsible for those awesome little uh, running s- the Sanic and the uh, uh, Ugandan knuckles. Her that dollar. Her Michael dollar Wall. donation got to that. Uh, Jennifer actually gets to pick. We're probably just gonna have to do it. God, it's gonna have to be like Monday night. So Monday night, I'm planning for it. Uh, we are gonna live stream us watching Velocipaster. So on Monday night, <laughs> uh, Jennifer is a ten dollar up patron, and she decided that Velocipaster is gonna be the movie that we're gonna do a watch along with. You can go on Amazon Prime, and it's on there. Uh, we're not gonna show the movie, but we're gonna broadcast us watching it, and then uh, we can talk about it, and it's gonna be insane. We also have this awesome set of stickers from our great friend uh, Victoria. Victoria made these stickers for us. They're our little geek boys. They're awesome. We gotta get them They're on so our. So awesome. I gotta get that on my microphone. So One is definitely we... going on the back of my car. Yep. Um, and I'm gonna put these on our microphones and stuff. I'm gonna put uh, a few of these in the loot boxes that we're gonna send out. So if you go to our Patreon, it's patreoncom geekculture. That's G33K culture. Uh, you can be. I think it's ten dollars and up, and you will be automatically entered into a uh, monthly or bi-monthly drawing. And I really gotta get our notes in for this stuff. Just go check it out. Geek Culture uh, at Patreon. G33K Culture. Paul, you got anything going on in your life today? Um, not, th- not today specifically, but... <laughs> no! Today. today specifically, though, we were going to play some... Uh, sea of Thieves? Sea of Thieves? I can sea never remember the name of the I know. Game. I, I, I was not know what As soon as I couldn't remember it, I was like, nah, I feel like, damn. Because <laughs> normally I don't have a problem remembering that. Well, I tell my dad all the time, alright, I'm going to go play that pirate game. <laughs> I was literally just going to say the pirate game. Sea of Thieves. It's literally just another name for pirate. It's such a perfect game for us all to stream together. Hey, tell, yeah. them, tell them what happened to our, our game last week. If you, go back and, if you go back and watch it, it's uh, going to be a rough watch because my internet stuttered, stuttered a lot. But I'll probably re-upload it and put it on YouTube. YouTube.com slash geekculture, G33K culture. Um, they 
So you go to these skulls, there's like these floating skulls, and you go to them, and they're fortresses. And you just fight wave after wave after wave of bad guys, and we're doing everything. We spot a ship kind of far off, but for a good 30 minutes, they're doing their own thing, leaving us alone. We get to the very last guy, the last person. One guy. He's this really cool captain. He's got like the uh, ship's steering wheel like broken and into pieces as armor. Yeah, he's really awesome. Takes a crap load of hits. To take so we're down. fighting him, fighting him, fighting him. This ship shows up. For some reason, the skeletons start spawning back into the towers and then just start firing at us. So they're firing at us. That other ship decides, yeah, I'm going to go screw with those guys. Last round. Last one, the last dude. They come up, so we're getting in a ship battle with these other ones. Paul's trying to fight off guys in the tower. Dale and I are running around on the ground. Um, yeah, I'm in the ship. It's total with chaos. With the cannons, and I'm trying to shoot the towers that are shooting at us while I can see that the ship is coming right for us. Right. And it's just like, ha, 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 so it's time to get them. So it circles away, and then it, we're thinking we're done. It comes back, completely took us off guard. It was like another group of three. We end up dying. Our ship gets sunk. We lose the five skulls that we had on there already, which are incredibly valuable. We lost two hours of work. Uh, they ended up taking out the last guy because you can see the skull from pretty much anywhere in the map. And Dale looks up and it just dissolves, which means they <laughs> took it out. So I check our map. It looks like we found the guys. I found the island. We see a ship. We're like, let's go get that ship. A ghost ship appears. Which are amazing looking. <laughs> it just comes out of the water next to it. Awesome. <laughs> this is like you're playing Pirates of the Caribbean, the game. It's If they made this and just put a Pirates of the Caribbean skin over it, it would be so much more popular. Because it's a good game. But that's it's what they just been around for a few years, hasn't it? It's, yeah, but it's like, it's like your No Man's Sky or Fallout 76. It's a build-upon game. You might not like it in the beginning, and that might turn you away forever. But eventually, yeah. the game gets really, really good. It becomes what they say... They, they what it should have been. Was gonna be. Right. It's like Fable. It took like three for them to do everything he said he can do in one. Um, or your favorite game that you like to play all the time. Uh, no, Man's no Man's Sky? Sky? Yeah. Well, that's yeah. what yeah. I just said. Yeah. Yeah. No Man's okay. Sky went from being nothing. Nothing. Like To now it's a VR co-op experience <laughs> where you can play with tons of people and base build and do oh my God. everything. Base building is just endless. In and you know game. if you don't... But you, you don't, can just build a base on one planet... Go to another planet, build a base on right. that planet. And then when you're at your station, you can just get shipped to your planet. So you don't yeah, have you can to just go teleport. fly. You can take a teleporter to all of your different bases. Yeah. It's you a lot of fun. You can't take a teleporter to your ship. Right. To your, to your, uh, Up. your, your flagship or whatever right. you call it. Your, but you, your get, you get that now. So it's not like you just have to fly up to like the space stations. You get like a fleet. You can you, have well, a you fleet a, of ships. Yeah, you get a freighter and you get a bunch of frigates. Which yeah. are pretty that you can send on missions, but you can also follow them on their missions right. and see everything that they do that they're reporting on when they come back. Because they'll be like, "Yeah, we went to this planet, uh, we sold a bunch of this stuff, and then we went here, and there was a battle going on, so we took part, and we won, and we got all, and they paid us this much money for helping." And then, I mean, you can go through and follow them and watch them do all that stuff while they go, you know, on a twenty-hour mission. Yeah, and it's in VR now. It's in VR. So, I mean, you want to get really sick, do it. Immediately do barrel rolls. Oh, you know what I should do while you guys are here? Uh, I have the demo for uh, Iron Man VR. No, I thought and I really want to play it. So maybe we'll do that. I'll stream that really quick to our YouTube just to see if I don't cool. puke my brains out. Um, then we'll go from there. I've got some other ones that we should do in VR, like Batman. Yeah, I've dude, got Batman. I have the Arkham one. I only have the. It's real short. It's like thirty minutes. We just play straight through. We've been doing the Kingdom Hearts one because they keep adding to Kingdom Hearts. I don't know if they add to the last level. I think it's the. I think it's the Coliseum. <laughs> My daughter's watching Princess and the Frog, so you might hear her singing randomly. She sings. She sings uh, all the time. That's why she's learned a lot of the words that she knows is uh, Frozen and Frozen Two. Um, but. <laughs> I totally lost my train of thought. Thanks, Scarlett. <laughs> this is what happens when you're live out inside my house. You're talking about VR, Batman. Oh, there's a, um, there's a Spider-Man one. The Kingdom Hearts oh, one. God. This Kingdom Hearts one is awesome because you just sit. Like, one of them, you're just sitting on the main island with uh, Riku and Kairi. Are you on the, the clock tower? 
That is one of them. No, that's when you're eating ice cream yeah. with um, what's his name? Uh, it's the Axel two and, uh, and the other girl and her or whatever. But you sit on the you sit on the tree and you sit there and talk to them and then this amazing fireworks show happens where it shows you like all these different cutscenes. It plays one of the most iconic songs in all of video games. Ding ding ding. ding it's, uh, so it's like a ding, ding. VR experience. That's what it's called. It's called the Kingdom Hearts VR experience. And then you depends what the Spider Man. The first one you do is uh, you're in the gummy ship. You're sitting in the gummy ship flying, and you look, and there's fucking Donald and Goofy. What about Chip and Dale? Are they on the... I think they come on your screen or something. Um, and then they have, you do the clock tower, they have the Coliseum, and they have a couple, they've been adding them as they've been going along. So I've had the game for over a year now, and I think they're at four or five worlds that they've added to it. It's a free game. I mean, they're just like, here you go. Yeah, the a lot Spider -Man of the one, experiences are like the both Spider-Man ones. Spider-Man? Awesome. There's one for both movies. Did you do the, the when you're on the crane and everything? No, I haven't done them at all. It's, so I let my my friend, I uh, let his son do it. And he's standing there and he's on the crane. And I just stood behind him and I gave him a little nudge. And it scared <laughs> the crap out of him. Because as, as bad as one, the graphics might be for these VR games, they're so immersive that when I did it and you pull you web swing up to the thing, you're like, there's the one where you're, there's the, there's the game. I think you can only get it on PC though. Um, where it's it's called some, somebody's plank game, and you just walk a plank. It's oh, like no. outside of a building. No, nope. and nope. you're looking down. No, nope. yeah, nope. no. And then <laughs> that like, makes, they that... want you to play it where you actually like put a plank on the ground and try to stand on it. Nope, I would be falling. Yeah, yeah. Spider Man. You were talking about that. It's giving me vertigo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? Like I would be like, I'm gonna to, hold this table. I so have I don't to pass crawl. Out. Can I crawl? Thanks for the share, Aunt Pat. No, thank you for the share. Thanks for the 150 stars, Dale. Good job, Dale. <laughs> Thank you for those 150 stars. Yeah. It came up? Cool. It didn't come up as... Oh, wait a minute. No, it didn't. No. It didn't come up on the screen? No. The alert? Yeah. I can try it again. Well, let's just... We'll figure it out during the break. Which we are going to take a quick break when we come back. Things? <laughs> we'll be right back. Hi for me, Scythe and Hunter. Hi Jennifer Scythe and Hunter. Hey Jennifer Scythe and Hunter.
<laughs> oh god. Hey guys. Oh, why so glum? Why so glum? We're not glum because we got these really raggy culture stickers. Uh, if you want to support our show, you can go to our Patreon. It's tagged in there. We also have a geekculture.live where you can buy hats and t-shirts and bags <laughs> and all kinds of things. You can hear that of all the things. Yeah, it's on my right side. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we sit the way we sit. We don't sit this way for any other reason that Paul won't be able to hear me if I'm on his other side. So Paul, why don't you tell us a little bit about that. When did you go to death? <laughs> when did I go to death? Was it my house? Uh, no, it was at Steve's house. Um, well, actually, it was like an all-day thing. Um, Your house is cursed. Basically, I woke up. I woke up. For him? I, what, when was that? Like he goes deaf. He bashes his face open. That was probably like 2004. It's been a long time. Um, yeah, I woke up and I couldn't hear out of it. And as the day went on, I just started feeling more. Like, I went on. I actually went on a date that day. And this totally screwed that whole thing up. <laughs> Um, what? <laughs> like, hey, my name is Christopher. Well, what? <laughs> we went and saw a movie, and like, I couldn't like, I was not concentrating on anything other than the fact that I could not hear out of my ear. And I was like, well, during the movie, I started feeling a little dizzy. Yeah, that's your equilibrium. And then, uh, <laughs> and then I went to Steve's house, and by and once we were there. Um, I got so dizzy that I was like, I can't drive. It was like I was drunk, but I wasn't drunk, so it was no fun at all. <laughs> um, everything was spinning. Um, and Dale was like, hey, man, you should just crash at my house. <laughs> so you, I ended up staying there for like two days. Yeah, and then we still, like, your dad had to come and get your car. Like, we had to. Uh, yeah, you drove me home. Right, and then my dad had to come get the car, yeah. Because I said, I was like two weeks bedridden because I couldn't, I was dizzy, literally yeah. dizzy for two weeks straight. Why don't you tell me about when you uh, handed me your cigarette and like, hey, hold this for a second. Yeah, let's just make this episode about <laughs> terrible things that <laughs> yeah, have happened. Why? Oh. So why? this, so if you watch uh, what we do in the shadows, if you haven't, it's a fantastic show. You can catch up on Hulu right now. Um, Dale's house is like the, the hat that Laszlo and what's his name, the defiler, or not the defiler, the deceiver? I can't remember. It's the one guy I hate. Chris. The, no, it's Nick, Nick, Nick Kroll. Kroll. I hate that guy. Yeah. Not I hate cool. you if you're watching the show, by the way. Awesome uh, that you are, though. Yeah, cool. Thanks for watching it. <laughs> Thanks for watching it, Nick. Go to Geek Culture on Patreon, Nick, and help us out. Um, but they they fight over this witch's hat, <laughs> and uh, it's cursed, and everything that every time they wear or something happens, it's just a terrible thing. So. And it's also made from the sphincters of witches. It's witch skin. <laughs> suckles on the I top want, of your yep, head. The, the sphincter suckles the top of your head when you wear it. Yeah, you gotta watch this show. <laughs> and it's cursed. So every time. But the guy, they both fight over it. And uh, every time they wear it, it's like instantly something happens. The guy wears it. He gets hit by a car. Hit by another car. And then he just keeps getting hit by cars. <laughs> and he just won't stop getting hit by cars. The fantastic show. Watch the movie too. Also fantastic. We gotta watch the movie. I got that. Thanks yeah. for sharing, Courtney. We could do that as a watch along. Oh yeah, we should definitely do that as a watch along too. So we're gonna do Velocipaster on Monday. Uh, we'll probably do it. Yeah, what time? Do you guys work Monday nights? Mm -hmm. Nothing. I don't work on. I don't. I'll I be, think I. Oh, I close. Monday. Okay, so then we'll do it like 9 p.m. Six. So at 9 p.m. on Monday night, we're gonna watch Velocipaster. Uh, it should be a movie. <laughs> it's a movie. It's a movie. <laughs> and if you want to pick the movies that we watch. Or if you'd like a really cool sticker, go to our Patreon and become a $10 and up backer and you'll be uh, eligible to get our loot box, which is send out a bunch of cool stuff and you'll be able to get our videos earlier and you're also able um, to pick the movie that we're going to watch. So, Aunt Pat, if you got a cool movie you want us to watch, then do it. Or, this sounds like it'd be the perfect thing for Daddy-O. Yeah, right. Like, Daddy-O has some obscure yeah. thing to... Right, he's, well, you know, he loves watching things with everyone. He's like, we got a movie to watch. Yeah. Well, let's do it with everybody. Yeah. And then now, Daddy, if you fall asleep during it, we won't notice. You can just <laughs> sleep. <laughs> it's his favorite part of movies. It's falling asleep during the opening credits. If Y'all want to watch this movie? If he hasn't commented at all, we'll just assume he is asleep. 
Oh, yeah. He probably does that while he's watching our show, too. He has. Oh, yeah. I'm <laughs> Which, sure he falls asleep during our show as well. Which is totally fine, I, you know. Yeah, it does. Well, it still Daddy-o, gets us a view. With daddy it doesn't mean anything. Like, it's not like he's so bored he fell asleep. Yeah. He's just, he's just like... He's just a narcoleptic. He's, I was literally about to say that. <laughs> he's a pre-narcoleptic. Daddy-o. Hey! 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 hey. hey. Love you, daddy Hey, he's watching. He's not sleeping. <laughs> well, it's true, though, because uh, there... The McCollum family are this one of like people that buy CDs are some of the only people that watch regular television. <laughs> <laughs> so, so PBR. they record everything. That's true. You it know is. when Daddy was asleep because we actually see a commercial. Yep. When you see a commercial playing and it has nothing to do with like Kiss or something that Daddy loves, and he's like, "Did you see that this was in this commercial?" He's asleep. We were watching Almost Famous yesterday. There's a small, small shot of this dude sitting in the cab. It's like a two-second shot. This kid just walks by, looks in the cab, and there's this guy. He's like, oh, hey, that's this guy. <laughs> and it was. Yep. <laughs> it was. <laughs> we need to get, uh, we need to get daddy on the show sometime. Uh, that's what we need to do. We need to do an episode where we get our dads on the show. All at once or one at a time? We could. That would be awesome. We could. I don't think my dad has ever met either. Well, he's met your dad. I don't think he's met Jason's I don't know if he's dad. met my dad. I know my mom has. Yeah, which is funny because I've known you for 20 years. <laughs> 22 or 3 years now. 23. Yeah, and uh, that would be amazing. So we might do an episode. Maybe next week if we can get it planned. Is your dad in town or are they still in North Carolina? They're, they're back. Okay, cool. Um, either way, though, I mean, it's not like he's... Busy in North Carolina. He's less busy. <laughs> he's doing less. He might not have a way to like film himself. Oh, he's got a phone. Yeah. Well, Th- thanks for liking the stream, Courtney. You know the way. Thank you, Courtney. Courtney. Can it. Can it. Yes. He knows the way. Don't but can it. Both of my parents. Tell everyone. Both of my parents have been watching the show since we started it. Yeah, which is the fantastic. The whole reason we don't curse like we normally would. Yep. I only said the <laughs> F word once. What today? Yeah, I said the F word. It <laughs> slipped right past you guys. <laughs> I, I, I don't, I don't really bat an eye at it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we got to the point. As long we as talked about this like, last week. As We're long not... as it's not like F this, F that, blah blah. Oh yeah, well you know me. I pre, with everything going on currently it's in our PG, country, it's PG thirteen. I... So you're allowed one. You're allowed to have one uh, F bomb. Okay, so we got it all ready. We Damn. got our F bomb. It's funny if you go back. There's certain people that you watch on YouTube. And I love missing when they don't get that edit. And then you go back and you're like, wait, did they just say the F word? Like, they don't even, they censor out like, shit. I was watching <laughs> uh, DBZ Abridged, and they usually censor out the F word. Oh, in early but, episodes they did. But then, no, even in like later episodes, they'll, they'll censor out certain F words, but there'll be like one where they just, they just let it go. Oh, so I was corrected. No! Apparently she's heard this a lot in her life. It's, like can and net, not can and it. Can no, it. I'm still gonna go with can it because it <laughs> works. Don't can it. Keep telling everybody about our show. <laughs> She'll never watch. Or again. you can tell everybody about our show. <laughs> we're, we're about the net. I don't know. Go on the net. Have you seen the net? It the can. Net is a great movie. The net was a great movie. <laughs> it's a great movie. Great. Sandra Bullock. Sandra Bullock. At her best. Right. I hate Sandra. Well, you hate Bullen. I love Speed, though. I, bet you I don't do. mean the movie. Whoa. Doesn't. Wow. Dale wants yeah, to be on we, our show. We all jumped to that conclusion, Dale. Yeah, you don't have to, <laughs> you don't have to explain it. <laughs> like, like when I took the picture of the uh, Geek Boy sticker on my dresser. Oh, I expected you guys to talk shit about Austin Alexandria and ICP and then make a comment that the only good thing in this picture, besides Geek Boy, was Leon Kennedy. Oh, no, I was going to talk crap about Leon Kennedy. I was going to be like, well, he's no Jill Valentine. I wasn't even going to say Chris Redfield, because I don't like Chris Redfield either. The best character is Jill. I never played as Chris. As no. many times as I beat Resident Evil, never, about, never played it as Chris. The only time I ever played as Chris is when 5 made me. What about in 2? So you played Claire? Oh, yeah. Claire Redfield? Yeah. It's Claire and Leon in 2. Right. That's what I said. Claire Redfield. I played as The oh. only Redfield I ever played as was Claire. Was Claire. Until they forced me to play it. Because I just had so much fun with Jill. And then you what about see, in five? You have to play as him. Unless I played with you guys and you wanted to be Chris, then I could be the girl. I don't what remember was her, her name. name. Oh my I god. I don't know. I don't remember. I don't remember her name. I always played as her too. I just I tried love that not to remember the five. The bow and arrow was just so yeah. good. Yeah, five was, was not a great game. What? It was good as far as the play got played. Was, I, I it was so not a resi. That's when, that's when they kept going with the, these aren't zombies anymore. And that's when I was like, Lost nope, done. Don't care. Because I didn't like four. I don't. 
to this day, still like horror. But you like the because you like the survival uh, horror. I don't like well, action. Not survival. Not necessarily survival horror, but like the puzzle solving. Um, I don't like, like fast paced action. The first three games. Movie. The first three or games game. were like. You know, you run around and you have to like find certain things. It was a strategy like, game. Everywhere. Yeah. It was well, a survival it's... strategy. Like it wasn't just like run, 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 It's an adventure. It's like Explosion. an adventure. It's an adventure game and not an action game. Yeah, they shouldn't be action games. It kills the flow. And that's It'd be like the, Silent the, Hill that's being like, new you know what? <laughs> Screw this! And he like kicks the door. Where's my daughter? Boom! Boom! You just like running through Harry Mason's like, where's my fucking daughter? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the remake for the the Wii, you don't fight anything, anything. at all. Is that the, yeah? You that's the right. like the first person one, right? No, it's third person. Is it? I thought yeah. okay. It's like sh- it's not Shattered Dreams or something like that. Shattered Memories. Yeah, it's something like that. Um, it took me a while to actually go back and play like with Silent Hill Three. That game was great. I went back and played that one way after, and I beat that in like a weekend, I think. It's a really good game. I love sitting and just playing those games. Okay. Those are the some early of the games Silent I Hills and like the early Resident Evils you could beat in a weekend. Yeah, well, if I mean, not a day. In a day, so you good at, at Star or Star Fox. Star Fox. <laughs> <laughs> See, Harry Mason's like, I ain't taking these shit anymore. Yeah. Well, you could beat Star Fox in a day. Oh yeah. Yeah, oh, my I God, was, you could beat, beat like Star an hour. Fox in like an hour. I was so disappointed. I went with that game over Super Mario World or Super Mario 64 when I first got my 64, and then I got home. Beat it an hour and a half is just what the hell did I just do? Yeah, see that would be a good game if you like. That's a good game like on top of Mario because like your friends can come over and you guys can play it together because it had multiplayer oh, and it yeah. had the vehicles. Remember you could run around. Yeah. Um. So you had the multiplayer for, but yeah, you're right. It's like branching path done. Super Mario 64 is like this gonna take you a long time, <laughs> yeah. a very long time. And we're gonna give you a reason. To do these over again. Yeah, they're like, hey, you can get all them stars. Yeah, you can play, you gotta play this level like ten times and to get every star. There's a secret six star on each level. Crazy. It's actually just collecting a hundred coins, but still. Yeah, but still. Uh, thanks for liking the stream, Dennis. Thank you, Dennis. Dennis, my twin brother. Thank looks, you. Looks nothing like him. Doesn't even look like we're related. <laughs> <laughs> just how it goes. Sometimes. You kind of look like you're related. You don't look like you're related. No. Um. Yeah, and then Star Fox Two. I beat it on your oh, yeah. Super Nintendo Mini or whatever it is. Yeah, oh, that's that, NES Mini. It was <clears throat> awful. The game was absolutely eh, terrible. At the time, I think it would have been pretty cool. It's, I mean, it was um, Star Fox. If you play the original Star Fox, I mean, it's it like was, six polygons. I'm like, that's a shit! Yeah. <laughs> well, it brings, me, it brings me back to the first that's time two I played polygons and a square. the X-Wing and TIE Fighter games on my computer. I mean, that's what they looked like. Oh, yeah. And they were a little bit bigger, and everything kind of ran a little bit better. Yeah. But... Yeah, if I could do that on a Super Nintendo, I would have been pretty blown away by it. Yeah, the second one. Yeah, but cool. again, you went, you left to go get something, and you were gone for like maybe a half an hour. I and probably I, went to pick the kids up. <laughs> I went. I, I I turned it on. I sat there and just looked at all the games, <laughs> trying to figure out which one I wanted to play for maybe like ten minutes, and then picked Star Fox Two <laughs> and beat it before you got home. And your brother says, "Don't be telling everyone that." Wow. <laughs> Yeah. Welcome back, Aunt Pat. Whatever it is. Your video chat is not as important as I had show. a video chat. Yeah. You're currently on a video chat. Yeah. Right you just don't. Well, this is a video chat. We've got 16 viewers. Why don't you pander the Patreon? Hey, pander the Patreon. It's a pander pander moment. There's a Dale pander pander moment. Hey, Dale, why don't you pander the Patreon? Okay. you. It's actually pinned in the comments. Can we stop talking about it like we're doing something bad or disgusting to the Patreon? To Who, our patrons? Can you you, you want to pander, pander the Patreon? Well, I mean, go pander that. Patreon. But pander. everybody loves the panda. pander that Patreon. They love that Patreon. It's the pander panda. Or you can go to geekculture.live and buy a bag of <laughs> shoes. A sports bra. Uh, yeah, sports bra. <laughs> With Geek Boy on it. With Geek Boy on it. So well, just go to patreon.com slash geekculture. That's G33K culture. Thank you to all of our patrons. That's boy. Jennifer, Catherine, uh, Pablo, uh, uh, Jake. your Jake. Chris. Did you say you're Jake? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I missed what just happened. Whoever liked the uh, stream, thank you. I'm sorry if I, I didn't see who, who did it. It was Jennifer. Oh, thank you, Jennifer. Did you share the stream? Hey, no, it didn't say you shared the stream. It said you liked it, so it's still not saying that you share it. Um, I'm still missing Vivian. 
And I believe that's it. But any donation is, is worthwhile. We don't spend a single penny of it you on ourselves. Kevin? What? You said Kevin? And Kevin. Of course. Kevin. How could I forget Kevin? Kevin? Yeah. Gosh. I mean, <laughs> with a name like Kevin. Uh, Vivian literally donated a dollar, and that's how we uh, we decided to torture Paul because he hates uh, memes that are, are two years old for some reason. They're just is older than two years. They're right. The guy that literally like was born old. a four-year-old <laughs> man hates classic it's things. Like, eight like if there's anything I know about Paul, it's classic rock, and he's like, memes that are two years old. <laughs> <laughs> I hate people who are talking. Oh, I'll listen to Journey all day, has, but not old enough. Knuckles. It's not old enough to, to be, be a classic. To be a classic. So in 20 years, Man. Paul's gonna be like, "You remember Uganda Knuckles? <laughs> that was good. That was good. That was good. I remember listening to Journey and showing people they weigh. <laughs> Do you know he weighed my butt? <laughs> you forgot Kevin. Yeah, I was screaming Kevin at you. No, she says forget Kevin. Oh, forget him. Kevin, <laughs> Eric. Forget Kevin. I, I don't remember. I keep forgetting. If well, he, then that's the, that's the joke Is now. he Kevin or Eric? <laughs> I don't know. That's the joke now. Because I remember she she corrects us every week, and I, I still don't know. I'm pretty what? sure his name is actually Eric. Oh, we don't want that then. It's Kevin. All right, Kevin. He doesn't watch the show anymore anyway. Wow, Kevin. <laughs> He's still Neither does Vivian. Wow, so Vivian. The, the other thing you get with a Patreon subscription is you get entered in a chance to win our loot, our loot box, box or yep, which you'll get one of these cool things it? in it. Geek it's box. our geek box. The geek box? Our geek box. Love you too, Janice. Geek box will have a sticker, at least a sticker. At least one. Well, we're going <laughs> to sign the things. I have like a bunch of like just retro, just nonsense. It's well, just going to be a bunch of cool stuff. You just already announced the first winner of the first Yeah, box. it's Jennifer. Uh... So she'll be getting that, and we'll send it to her. She's local, so maybe we'll just give it to you. <laughs> Save me some shipping. Hi. Okay. Kevin doesn't watch, but still asks me why you say that. Why we say what, Kevin. Eric? <laughs> or whatever your real name is, <laughs> Kevin. <laughs> I don't know. You say me, Carrick. Yeah. Carrick. Yeah, Carrick. Kevrick. Evan. Oh. Evan. <laughs> it's like the planet Arium. <laughs> if that's your real name, Evan. 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 Well, e Evan, yeah, with the K. This, this joke just evolved. 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 Evan. <laughs> if that's your real name. It evolves what? every week. What? With a Cockney K. Guys. Evan. 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 Oi. Ah, this so is exactly topic? why you should donate to us. <laughs> so what's the topic for today's for, episode? This topic? I've worked 40 minutes into the episode. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm, I'm just trying to kill time to get to quiz time. <laughs> quiz time. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got a quiz that took me five seconds to do. I can't believe that. Yeah, what's your I'm excuse good. every other day? I'm no, well, you know why? I hope it's based on what the show was supposed to be about. It is. Oh, my God. <laughs> So yeah. we had a little hiccup in our uh, broadcast. We really appreciate everyone understanding. Um, yeah, we'll try and, and reset. We'll, we'll re. Yeah, uh, we'll we'll make so it do, up to do you. We, we should go over like why we were going to have this specific guest on, right? Okay, so we sponsor a local wrestling fed. They're called Original Championship Wrestling. They have a show coming up July twenty. This, I think he sent me the information. I'm just very terrible. real professional here. At Geek Culture. So much so, but my producer could look it up for me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's me. Oh, no. Um, <laughs> no, it's a uh, so the original championship wrestling. They they are local fed. We used to we used to actually all wrestle ourselves. We started in the backyard way way before it was cool, and uh, <laughs> we made it. We did. We made it good. We had so much fun wrestling in my backyard. We street. had, well, we did like real wrestling. And yeah, <laughs> sure. as opposed to XHW with Chainsaw, where all they did was like tubes and yeah. tubes. calling you out, Adam. Yeah, Adam. <laughs> yeah, Adam. Yeah, Adam. Hitting and me with a baseball bat with tacks on it. Yeah, you post a lot of amazing memes, though. He posts some really great some stuff. Some really yeah. vulgar. Stuff. Oh my god, I love he him. He also steals a lot of my stuff. Does he like it though? Yeah. See, he he posted this morning that he was stealing your your yeah. thing, yeah, and like, then yeah. and then no, see, but he I liked got, it too. I have friends like Joe Alonia, 
who don't like my stuff and then share it. So like it if you're going to share it. <laughs> give me my credit. You're right. Because you know what I'm going to do? I'm not going to give you yours because I'm going to right click and save picture as and post it like it was mine. So I assure you whoever I stole it from, <laughs> when you're stealing it from me, I stole it from someone else and, and I liked it. Liked it. So, uh, Live Pro Wrestling Justice for All show, July 25th. There you at go. Next Step Fitness, 1600 Southwest 17th Avenue, 34471. Doors open at 6.30, bell time 7. Kids under 12 are free. Adults, $10. And if you want to, uh, if you can find them on the on Facebook, you can uh, pin their thing. I think it's, oh, uh, yeah. it's at Original Championship Wrestling. If you, uh, if you might be able to type that in the chat, and it, might, it may tag them in it. But it's at Original Championship Wrestling. They got a lot of great workers. Uh, Thrasher, former WWF Tag Team Champion, is going to be there. He's actually half of their Tag Team uh, Champions. So we'll see if maybe we can talk to him a little bit. Him and Paul got a great rapport, if you've seen him. <laughs> uh, he's a really big fan of Paul's and geek culture. He loved the name. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, we'll... Uh, he was really cool. We're definitely going to be there. Uh, I don't know how everything is going to go. Florida is a little wonky. wonky when it comes to what our state leader wants us to do. Um, so we'll see. But it's in July, so you got plenty of time. Hopefully, uh, hopefully things will get a little better. They're all over the place. So we actually are going to do quiz time in a minute. We're going to take a quick break. I'm going to make sure my kid is not burning the bedroom down. Because every time I look over, she's got the door opening and smiling. So. <laughs> What's and going it's, on? And man? it's quiet now. So something is amiss. So we'll be right back with quiz time. Quiz time. It's quiz time. I'm yeah. not wearing any pants. Yeah. Yeah. See you guys in just um, two minutes.
So yeah, Paul's favorite part of the show and mine, because I get to get him angry a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do quiz time. Quiz time. Oh yeah. Today's quiz is how many puppies does it take to get a million views? <laughs> this puppy you all see is getting much, much bigger. Hey, Dooney. Oh, hi, sweetie. <laughs> Those blue eyes. Yes. All right. She get is, out of here. She is a beautiful... <laughs> oh, yeah, look. There's Clope's caption right there. Mine isn't on this week. Why is mine on? Did I turn it on? My, it just started coming on on mine, like with all the Facebook live streams that I watch. I have it off. Hi, Kristen. I don't have... It's mine actually says mine. off, though. It's not going, going on, on mine. Why, are, why is the well, background hit... in front of us? Why is what? Oh, that's fine. It's not. That's the chat. That's the <laughs> yeah, chat. You're We're going, just... you're going <laughs> off camera is what's happening. All right. Yeah. So, <laughs> it's you the is... What's the background? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. It's quiz time. <laughs> okay. It's quiz time. Quiz time, yeah. If you're just joining us, you're in the last 15 minutes of the show, so good job. <laughs> Where's Pablo and Catherine? That's usually when they join. No, Catherine's going to join when we're two minutes over. <laughs> at 105 is when Catherine joins. So thank you, Catherine, for Catherine your Catherine might think the show starts at 1. Yeah, I know. Even though for eight months we have been doing it at noon. She's been here for it. Right. Thanks, Jeremy. <laughs> She's like, been right? on the show. <laughs> she was a guest. Our first guest. No, no M99 no. was our first yeah. guest. We need to get them back on. Yeah. We should get them back on. I need on. to get a hold of our my, my friend Branson, the comic guy, so I can get him on the show too. But okay, so quiz time, <laughs> quiz time, quiz All right. time. Yeah. So I had to put I had to throw together a quiz. Uh, very quickly. We just got a like or something. So Thank you today, for it's, Jeremy. It's gonna Thank be you. today. It's gonna be a little bit different. Okay. Um, so uh, we were going to have a professional wrestler on. Um, so I kind of based it around having her on the show. So the questions kind of were pertaining to her. Yes. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to give you guys a uh, the name of a. Women's wrestler, okay, and a pro wrestler, mm -hmm. and you're gonna tell me how many letters I have to type into Google before they show up as number one on the search. Nice. And this That's is on my phone, so my phone might be having something to do with the search. <laughs> so keep that in mind. You Google lady wrestlers all the time? No, I don't. <laughs> I'm glad that we can get you out of work, Jeremy. Thank Jeremy you. was afraid that he was gonna have he wasn't gonna be able to see the stream because he was working, but the thing he was working with broke. <laughs> oh good. Sweet. Yeah. I hope you don't have to replace it with your own money. <laughs> yeah. Well, you made it in time for quiz time. Quiz time. Quiz time. <laughs> and it's wrestling, Jeremy, so oh, pants. did you see did you hear me explain how the game is working? Yes. You're going to say a name, and we're going to tell you how many letters you have to type in before that name appears as the top person. Right. Gotcha. Alondra Blaze. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> All of the letters? Yes. <laughs> All right, so first one is Mickey James. Um, so we're now, is this isn't multiple quests. Yeah, no, no, this is how many letters will you type in for Mickey James before her name appears? Are, are we counting spaces? No, those spaces aren't letters. <laughs> characters. So how many characters? No, don't count the space, just okay. count the letters. Okay. Um, not multiple choice, right? Yeah. Yeah, it is. It's oh, not, we're not, not just giving you no. a number. Whoever gets the closest gets the point. Okay, so Mickey James. That's M I C K I E, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. M O U S E, Mickey Mouse. Oh, boy! <laughs> you love that show, huh? Um, James. Mickey James. Mickey James. I'm gonna say eight. So before Mickey James is the top one, I'm gonna say six. I'll say eight. Two. Really? No, because I was looking for I was already searching for women's wrestling, so they're showing up quick. So Mickey Mouse was. I put in M I, and I got Mickey James as number one. Really? Yep. Not Mickey look? Mouse. Not Mickey Mouse. No. You were looking at Google. Yep. Okay. Huh. Wow. So how how do we score this? Two? Jason got the point because he said six. Got the eight. point. Okay. Jeez. Yep. So I like it. Some of them might come up quick. 
Well, it just depends oh, how. Oh, jeez, whoa! Just what? The chat just like went nuts. Did it? <laughs> yeah. Sorry, chat. <laughs> Brrr. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah, look at them all. <laughs> what is all that? Thanks for the love, everybody. Did we just get a bunch of people talking? No. Oh, it was just Jeremy's typing twenty sentences. Nah, that's. <laughs> <laughs> He's just saying how his machine broke. But yes, uh, the chat just went. Blah, 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 blah. So. Two. Two. So we just need to know how how closely Paul CIA guy is watching his phone. Pretty much, yeah. Got it. All right, number two. That's fine. Charlotte Flair. Ooh. See, I'm comparing it to other more, more popular names. Yeah, like mm -hmm. Mickey Mouse. But I'm comparing it to but like I was, the city. I, so I, I, <laughs> you got the right before the show. Charlotte. I googled. Uh, well, how many letters is her I, first I name? I googled like women's professional wrestler facts. How how many letters is her first name? Do you do you so know? Now do you have this, I want to know about C H A R L O T T E. Is it nine. is that how it's spelled? It's spelled like the city. Okay, so did you say nine? That's yeah. That's nine. Okay, so then eleven. Uh, eleven with eleven. I'm yeah. gonna say four. Four. It's three. Four. Really? <laughs> Woohoo! What? That just does not seem like enough. It's like the uh, sun sun suntan uh, commercial or bottle thing. Dogs biting the little girls. Oh butt. yeah, but now this dog's way bigger. Used to be little. Puppy. Oh. It is a puppy. <laughs> but have you searched her before? You see, you should have no. you should have cleared your history. Because when I typed in Mickey, it was five letters for me. I, well, I said this is my phone. It's like look. Okay, so that's that one. Five. No six on that one. Damn you, Charlotte. He type in six and she comes up before the city. Hi mom. Yeah. <laughs> Say hi to my mom. Alright. <clears throat> hi Ma. Thank you. Ma'am. <laughs> Alright, number three. Natalia Neidhart. Who? Natalia <laughs> Neidhart. I know. <laughs> N-A-T-A-L-I-A. Oh you hugging the puppy? No. Yeah. I really think I should have cleared my history. Yeah, because it's probably going to be like two. Because <laughs> N.A. should not bring up Natalia Nadar. Start basing your, your answers on the facts that you know. Two. <laughs> Three. <laughs> it's two. Yes! <laughs> he gets double points for getting it nailed on the head. Double point. Well, no, I'm only, I got two to your one. So we're still not, you know, it's only a question. Well, that's, that's what they used to do on the Jim Phillips show. Um, if you got it right on. Closest to the pin, if you got it right on. Well, good thing it. this that's isn't Jim Phillips. Yeah. It is, yeah. because then we wouldn't so, be hosting the show anymore. <laughs> and we would get a lot more views. As long as we're making that revenue. <laughs> Bill always knows how to promote our show. <laughs> Jim Phillips is retired, All so right, next. Can't go Jim him Phillips anymore. sucks. Oh, Jim no, Phillips Jim, oh. Colbert. No, sucks. Jim Phillips is so boring. Oh. Him and what's her name? You say that. Boy, him, him and you listen him and to him. You listened to him back when you were like, when he was boring. Young. Yeah, and he's still boring. He got I, he didn't become less boring as I got older. You thought well, you probably he started talking about been more, more interested the same in crap. the things he talked about as you got older. He's an old man. Boring. It's the radio. Listen Beth, to the radio. Beth Phoenix. Old man. <laughs> Beth Phoenix. Four. Three. Three. <laughs> this is the dumbest game ever. <laughs> this is yeah. You should have cleared your history. It's a good uh, concept for a game. Though. Well, if I, like I ever do this again, I'll clear my history. Yeah, clear your history. Just make sure to thumbnail all your porn. All right, I already know the answer to the next <laughs> one. Thumbnail it, because you'll never remember <laughs> those names. I'll never remember where. You'll never, you'll never remember some of the graphic names that these. <laughs> not that I've ever been on those websites or anything. I'm actually wearing my X Mart <laughs> shirt right now. Mm. That's why we keep you on the Mets side. Yeah, that's why we keep him off camera. Alright. Number five. That dog, man. I don't know. Scarlet, give him a bop. Oh my god. She, she just drags her down. She just goes. Yeah. <laughs> Back to puppy jail for you. Yeah, back to puppy jail. I know I'm trying to teach them all to be more assertive. I'm like, she's a dog. She's not as smart as a person. You gotta 
Yeah. She doesn't do that to me because I alpha mailed her. All right. Number I'm not five. beating my dog or anything before him. He goes, oh my god, what'd you do to that poor dog? He just throws her down the two flights of stairs. Right. <laughs> she bounces off the wall, then goes down the other, so she gets a chance to yeah. stop. He's got a bumper <laughs> like, in a, like in a pinball machine set at the bottom. Brrr, and you just hear, so you just, ding! No, it's, it's a curved <laughs> wall, so I know she just keeps the momentum. <laughs> Bam, all down the other side. She it's lands great. on you a crash pad. She's really rolling good, though. Right? Oh, yeah. That's why you tie her legs together. Without <laughs> throwing a puppy down. Chuck and roll. Number puppy. five. <laughs> this is what happens when our guest bails on us. <laughs> Number five. <laughs> Becky Lynch. One. <laughs> two. It's two. <laughs> this is the dumbest game ever. <laughs> Be Becky Lynch. Not. Beatles. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Here's Why one... would the Beatles come up before Becky Lynch? Here's one Lynch. question, and it's going to be worth two points. Two. Why are we about <laughs> leading, aren't I? Just two. No, it's tied, because I did give him the two points for getting it. So you gave me the two points. Oh, yeah, no, so you're winning. By one point. By a point. Okay. Two. So whoever gets this question right <laughs> two. wins. Two. How many women have been in the men's royal, men's royal rumble? Two. Nia Jax is Becky Lynch. He's not. He's not right. right. He's not right. No. <laughs> it's, I think it's three. I think it's three. It's Beth Phoenix, Austin Kong, or whatever they called her at the time, and Nia Jax. I think, yes, because because <clears throat> Austin Kong is the one that, it's, it's three. It should be three. Beth Phoenix, Nia Jax, uh, Austin Kong, or whatever she was called. I can't remember her name. Uh, remember Awesome Kong from TNA? Yeah. She was... Awesome Kong? She was in the Royal Rumble? Rumble? So she's related she to Donkey? No. Or King? <laughs> 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 no. She's big, terrifying lady. It should be... I think it's three. I didn't know that she was in it. I think it's three. Well, then it's four. <clears throat> no, it's three. What about China? <gasps> it's, four! <laughs> it's four! You still get it, though, because you're closer. Four. It's four. Yeah, it should be four. Yeah, because it was China, Beth Phoenix, Awesome Kong, and then Nia Jax. Yep. What did they, did they give you a list? Did they say it's four? Did they tell you who the four were? It wasn't Awesome, awesome Kong wasn't listed. Yeah. She's the only one that was missing, though. I think she was the one that, because I'm pretty sure she did it during um, the, oh God, what did they call her? She did it during the one where Michael Cole was in the ring and she eliminated it. Yeah, she debuted at the Royal Rumble. Karma was her name. Let's see. Yeah, her name was Karma. And she debuted at the Royal Rumble. And the WWE put a lot of money behind her. And she was coming in as like this, you know, oh my God, here she comes, this big destroyer. Yeah. And she got pregnant. And then never came back. WWE doesn't like it when you get pregnant. Well... Welcome back, Aunt Pat. Again. Yeah, so it should be four. So I win! <laughs> I can't yeah. believe you forgot about China, though. I did. But see, there she is. Yes! And she took out Dolph Ziggler. Look at that. Boop! She picked that man up in through mode. <laughs> yeah! Jason's the winner! <laughs> Of quiz time! Quiz, quiz time. time! So, as my daughter runs back and forth through the house screaming, Yay! Soon she'll start saying, We fun! Uh, <laughs> it is one o'clock, so it is time for us to go. We will be back in the next 30 minutes uh, to play Sea of Thieves. So, if you want to come back, we'll be Unless, on Facebook. You know, of course, something's going to go wrong, so it's not going to be 30 minutes. But... So, in the next hour, we'll be playing Sea of Thieves, so check back with us. Thank you very much. <laughs> to everybody that donates to our Patreon, we really appreciate all the help and support that you guys give yeah. us. There is tons of other things that you could do. I don't want to list them all right now because my daughter's going to interrupt me. She's probably going to start running again. She's starting to get tired. So, <laughs> thank you for everything, guys. Join us every single Friday at 12 p.m. I'm Jason. And I'm Paul. And there's Dale over there. Hi. There's Dale. Click Dale. Hi. See you guys next week. Yeah. Bye. Say bye. 
Bye bye. Nope. She's like, no. I don't know them. They're strangers. Who? (laughs) She's like, those people are strangers. I set that camera up pretty good, huh? Just boop right back there. I bet Paul's off camera. No, it's perfect. No, there we go. Now. (laughs) Geek culture live. Bye, Pat. Bye, Pat. Bye, guys. Thank you for joining us.